Hello, good night. Hello, good evening. How are you? Fine, fine. Thank you. Welcome. Thanks. What have you done today? Tell me something that you have done today. Something that you did today. Algo, algo que han hecho today? I go to work. Okay. Outside. Good. Where, where do you work? I work in, in network uh, installation. In, ah, okay. So in, you're doing uh, work. You're doing construction work. Uh, network, network installation. Ah, okay. Uh, so long net. <laughs> do you see a lot of people in the street? A lot of people? Uh, is, I see more more people. Okay. I, I see people. Okay. More, Seven more gente. <laughs> sí. Okay. Good. All right. Welcome. Welcome. Okay. So, how many people have done the the exam? El examen de de mitad que dice midterm. I don't. ¿Quién ha podido hacerlo? La mayoría. Okay, in the chat there, in the chat, eh, tell me yes or no. Si lo han hecho, sí o no. Estoy hablando del examen. ¿Dónde? En el chat. En el chat ahí en el grupo. Ya algunos que empezaron a contestar. Very good. Yes or no. Lo que, han, lo que lo, ya han hecho o no, el examen. Estoy hablando del examen del, de la mitad, de, después de la sección número 3, ¿verdad? Ok. Ok. Fíjense que casi todos. Ok, very good. Casi todos. Ok. So... Ok, so por, por fuerza de la mayoría, pues lo que voy a hacer simplemente voy a dejar que, el, que los que no lo han hecho eh, me puedan escribir a mí personalmente si tienen algunas dudas. Ok, si tienen algunas preguntas, simplemente me pueden escribir, ya que la mayoría una, ya, una... Ya, ya lo ha hecho. Uh -huh. Perdón, perdón, teacher. Y ese, ese enlace lo mandó al, al chat en grupo. ¿Cuál enlace, o, Joaquín? O, okay. o aparece después, de, después de la, del tercer capítulo, aparece ese examen. Sí, lo que correcto. Pasa que yo, uh -huh. Ah, ok. Lo que pasa es que yo terminé nada más el, el, uh -huh. el tercero y ahí me he quedado ahorita. Por eso no lo he visto entonces. Sí, está después de la... De hecho, está dentro de la sección 3, solamente que está abajo de la, en la sección 3. Dice midterm, o en algunos casos dice mid-exam que sería como la prueba del mitad del curso, ¿verdad? Terminando la sección 3. Sí. Uh -huh. Abajito de la sección 3. Yo, yo encontré, un, yo encontré un, 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 un quiz largo ahí de varias, de varias dice, interrogantes. Quizás quizá dice ese, entonces, ¿por qué? A, B, C, que hay secciones así que están por letra. Sí, sí, sí. Ese sí es. por letras. Ah, pues ya lo hice entonces. Ok, bueno, ok, perfect, perfect. Ok. Y hay, uno de, y, y hay una parte de que se escucha y se, y se, y se escucha el audio uno y va respondiendo, me parece. Mm, vaya, Joaquín, solo para que todos estemos en la misma página, voy a ir al curso de ustedes. Creo que pueden ver mi pantalla. Sí, la estamos viendo. Okay, um, section three, uh, you have under section three, tenemos eh, que dice homework or where are you from. Esa okay. sería la, la tarea de la que ustedes hacen todos los días. ¿no? And then midterm, right here. Uh, midterm, you have A, B, C, D, E. Uh -huh. ¿Ya lo hiciste? Sí, la tuve que haber terminado. Lo hice toda la sección okay. tres. Ok, so, fíjate allí. Y salen unos cheques aquí verdes, ¿verdad? Comprobando que ya le terminaste. Ok, so, 
All right, very good. Very good. So, ya que estoy acá, let me, uh, let me go back. Okay. Do you remember the activity that we did yesterday? Do you remember what we did yesterday? We practice WH questions with the verb to be. Okay. Se acuerdan? WH questions plus the verb to be. Ya lo voy a hacer más grande. Do you, do you remember how to do questions with the verb to be? For example, I want to use, um, I want to use what? What questions can I do with what? When you What's want to name? know more, more information about the person, what do you ask when you want to know their name? Question. Alguien lo dijo, pero bien, bien bajito. Say it. What is what your is name? Yes, very good. What Ooh. is your name? Very Ooh. good. Okay. Uh, what about questions with where? Where? You from? Where is your? Where is you from? Where is where your? Where from? Where is your address? Ah, okay. Where, where is your address? See. Where are you from? Okay. Very good. What about questions with how? Esta la que estábamos preguntando ayer. How many people listen to the radio? Listen to the radio. Okay, very good. How many people listen to the radio? Okay. Now, if I want to know the age of a person, how do I ask to know the age? How are you? How are you? Esto es para la edad? No, 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 no. How Pero... old are you? How old? Ah, okay. How, how old are, old you? are how, you? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now look. Informalmente, you can say, I'm 38. Informalmente. But if you want to uh, speak, you know, correctly, you can you can say, I am 38 years old. Years old. Yes. Very good. Okay. Porque cuando digo years old, I know that I'm talking about age. Okay. Very good. Uh, what about questions with... Um, uh, <laughs> Why? <laughs> Un poquito más difícil. Questions with why. Why? This is a little more difficult, but the same structure. We're going to use the same structure. WH plus verb to be. Why? Por qué? Why? What? Why? Are you listening the la the, the classroom? Why are uh, you listening? Are you listen, uh, listening. Uh, yes, listening. Uh -huh. the, the, the class, the classmate. Excuse me, classmate. ¿Por qué estás no. escuchando? Sí. Why are, Why are you, you listening? Listening. The classmate. To classmates. ¿Por qué estás escuchando ah, a, a, tu, a tus compañeros? A tu compañero. ¿Por qué estás escuchando a tus compañeros? Ok. Uh -huh. All right. I'll give you a simple one. Que sea más fácil. Why okay. are you sad? Why are you sad? ¿Por qué estás triste? Why are you sad? Why are you 
Tire. Prior. Tire. Llorando. Tire. Cansado. Tire. 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 Why are you tired? Uh -huh. Very good. Excellent. Okay. So we use verb to be and then we use I, a, a WH, perdón, and verb to be. Now, what questions can I ask when I'm having a conversation with someone? Maybe I am meeting someone. Estoy conociendo a alguien, primera vez, amistad, quiero hacer amistad con esa persona. What are some good questions that I can ask? Okay. No, no la voy a escribir. Quiero que practiquemos en grupos. Okay. So, primera vez que van a hablar con esa persona. Eh, hello, my name is Carlos. How are you? What's your name? Okay, y empiezan esas preguntas de introducción. Okay, so let's go to groups. We're going to practice WH plus verb to be questions. Let's go to groups. All right, uh, let's go to. Vamos a hacer grupos de tres o cuatro. No, uh, two, two people. I think we have enough for two or three people. Okay. Okay, algunos grupos van a tener dos o tres. Let's go to groups. Carla, Verónica, eh, Ricardo, si pueden ir a los grupos, por favor. Eh, Ricardo, te veo dos veces aquí, no sé en cuál dispositivo estás. Ok, eh, Ricardo, te acabo de enviar la invitación para el grupo. Hello, Carla, ¿me escucha? Hello. Bueno, voy a hacer una pregunta yo entonces. Hey. How? Bueno, what's your what's your name? Uh, my name is Mauricio. Okay. Okay. Ahora Mauricio, ya que tú contestaste, tú puedes hacerle la pregunta a Joaquín y así van mm. sucesivamente. Uh, where are you from? I'm from El Salvador. Very good. Now, ¿quién va a hacer la pregunta ahora? Joaquín. Where are you work? Mauricio 2. Morris 2. Uh, eh, I work. Eh, ¿Cómo sería ahí? Eh, in my house. Sí. Eh, I live eh, by, by family. Uh-huh, oh, five people. Oh, también. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. uh, sí, and you, Alejandra? I live 
with my father ah, and yes. me. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. Very good. But lo vamos a hacer así. Eh, for example, Alejandra, you can begin. You're going to ask a question to Herbert. Herbert, tú vas a contestar esa pregunta y después vas a hacer una pregunta a Kimberly. Kimberly, tú vas a contestar esa pregunta y hacerle una pregunta a Alejandra. Y así vamos a seguir. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Ready? Sí. And Herbert, what is your last name? Uh, it's last name uh, Cardenas. Very good. Now you are going to ask a question to Kimberly. Uh, Kimberly, uh, uh, how old are you? How, how, how old are you? I am 20 years old. Very good. Now you ask Alejandra. a question. Mm -hmm. Alejandra, what is your second name? Seven, 70, eh, ¿cómo se dice? Okay, I ha, eh, yes, I have a family. I live with my, um, my, uh, my husband mm -hmm. and two, uh, my two sons, uh, mm -hmm. two boys. Two boys. And my, how do you say, um, uh, mother-in-law. I have a mother-in-law in my house. I live ah, with my mother-in-law. Mother uh -huh. You live with your mother-in-law. Yes, okay. yes. Okay. The mother-in-law is a suegra, right? Yes. Sí. Ah. Okay. <laughs> yes, my mother-in-law, my husband, and two boys. Okay. Marvin, very, the, very the, good. Very good. Les le voy a dar una dinámica si la quieren usar. Como son tres, pueden hacer una cadena. Eh, Ivan, you can ask a question to Marvin. Marvin, you answer the question and then you ask a question to Larisa. Larisa, you answer and then you ask a question to Ivan. Okay. 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 Marvin, do, do you have a pet? Do you have a pet? A pet. What is the name of pet in, in Spanish? Mascota. Mascota. Uh, I have two dogs. He's, he's the herring. He's five, five years old. Five years old? Why? Mm -hmm. Espera, eh, espera, no, fight, 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 Okay, very good. So, como son tres, Verónica, tú le vas a hacer una pregunta a Marvin. Marvin, tú vas a contestar, hacerle una pregunta a Víctor. Víctor, tú vas a contestar, hacer una pregunta a Verónica. Y van a hacer una cadenita. Okay. Okay. So, what questions? Okay. ¿Escuchaste, Víctor? Vamos a hacer una cadenita. Verónica, yeah. you ask a question to Marvin. Marvin, you answer. And you ask a question to Victor. Victor, you answer. And you ask a question to Veronica. Okay. Any question? Okay. What is your name? How old are you? Where do you live? Why are you happy? Pueden hacer preguntas con el verb to be. Are you a doctor? Are you a student? All right. Very good. Okay. okay. Continue. Continue. Do you Veronica. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. It's going, Veronica is going to start, so vamos a dejar que, que la dama vaya primero. Go. <laughs> okay. Este, do you have sister, uh, brother? Who? Victor or Marvin? 
Victor, do you do you yes, have Yes, I have one sister. Uh, brothers. Uh, right. Okay, I have three brothers. Okay, hold. Now, hold. now, 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 Victor, is your turn. Okay, okay. Uh, Marvin, okay. Um, are you uh, Mm, are you a student? Yes, I am a student. Today I am uh, learning English with English, English Corporativo. Excellent. Good job, Marvin. Now, Marvin, you ask a question to Veronica. Veronica, uh, what do you do, Veronica? Perdón? What do you what? do? What do you do what? to improve your English? What do you do to improve to your English? Improve your English. What do you what do you do? Perdón. To La última improve. Palabra. What do you do to improve your English? La última pare la última palabra. La última no, parte do es do ¿Qué hace para mejorar? What do you do to improve your English? Uh, um, I am I am listening as English. Podrá? Okay. I am listening listen English. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. In the radio, TV? Uh, sí. Yes. Do you, sí. <laughs> do you watch TV in English? Do, <laughs> yes. I just, Okay, very good. Now, Veronica, your turn. Ask Victor a question. I want to listen music. I want to listen music. Yeah, I, I like, I would like, I would like. Te gustaría escuchar música. Ajá, esta semana. Ah, ok. ¿Qué me, me too. I would like to uh, see the movie. And, 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 and listen, list, listen, listening. And list. No, no sé cómo se dice escuchar. Listen. Listen. Yes. Uh, I would like to lis listen the music. Okay. Very good. Okay, so, preguntas con WH. ¿Qué podemos hacer? Ya vimos preguntas con el verb to be. No sé si, si se acuerdan, eh, for example, are you a student? Mm, are you a de, doctor? La de respuesta yes or no. Ajá, exacto. Esas son de respuesta yes or no. Esas son fáciles de responder. You say, yes, I am. No, I'm not. Okay. So, you can do those, but also you can ask WH questions. Uh, those, that is information questions. For example, where do you live? Uh, where do you work? What school do you go to? Okay. And questions like that, that you can ask. Okay. So, okay. so practice that, those questions. Ok. Entonces sería... Eh, eh, traten de, como, imagínate que, que se están conociendo, ¿verdad? Y eh, primera vez es, es, es tu compañera de clase, tu compañera de trabajo, primera vez que hablan. So, think about what questions will you ask the person? Where, cuando, where? Sería, where are you work? Okay. Esther. Ah, pero primero podría ser, are you, are you work? I do, do you work? Do you work? Mm -hmm. No es are. No, Sería, en ese En ese caso no, porque eh, es el uso de do, es un verbo auxiliar. Eh, todavía no hemos explicado eso. 
en esta, en esta sección, pero yes, you can say, eh, do you work? Do you work? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, where are you work? I am work in my house. Uh, okay. And you, where do you work? Uh, I work in Personal. Okay. Yes. Uh, how many? How many se puede? How many sería cuántos? En cantidad. Cuánto. Uh -huh. How many work? Mm, ¿Cuántos trabajan? No. O cuánto trabajas? Ah, uh, you can say how many hours do you work? Hours, horas uh -huh. trabajadas. How many hours do you work? Three hours. Three hours. Okay, very good. Now, Veron, uh, Esther, you can ask him a question. What questions can you ask him? Um, what do you do? What do you do? What do you do? ¿Qué hago? Mm -hmm. Yeah, for I example, am. like, like maybe. I am, ahí puedes usar el I am. I am in classroom. Okay. Uh, you can say, for example, I am a student. I, I am playing. A... Okay, eso es lo que estás haciendo ahorita, pero what do you do? Like, for example, professionally, or maybe uh, uh, what do you do? Uh, do you work? Are you a student? Okay, ahorita vamos a regresar al grupo. Okay. Okay, all right, very good. Welcome back. Okay, Some, eh, a lot of people are doing good questions. Algunos se les olvidó cómo hacer preguntas. Eh, algunos se olvidaron de el verb to be, ¿se acuerdan? ¿Cómo usar el verb to be en preguntas? Are you a student? Are you a doctor? Uh, are you a father? Okay. ¿Se acuerdan el uso de do? Do. Do. For example, you say, do you have a brother? Do you have a sister? Okay. What do you do? I am a, I am a student. Okay? I am a doctor. I am a mechanic. Okay? I am a teacher. Very good. So, lo que están estudiando ahorita es la base del inglés. Y es lo que lo que van a usar casi el 60% de las conversaciones en inglés, lo que se va a Lo que se va a hablar, lo están estudiando ahorita ustedes. Ok. So, eh, traten de, de captar esta sección, especialmente el uso del verb to be. ¿Se acuerdan que les dije que el, el verb to be es el, el, el verbo más importante en todo el inglés? Lo usamos para yes or no questions. Lo usamos para WH questions. Respondemos con el mismo verb to be. Preguntamos con el mismo verb to be. Hablamos en primera, segunda y tercera persona con el verb to be. Casi todo lo que usamos al día al día. Okay, very good. So, I want to go now to the next section. Um, yo creo que casi todos eh, ya completaron el examen, the midterm, okay. Um, a los que todavía no van por la mitad, eh, what you can do is if you have any questions, please tell me, okay. Si tienen alguna duda, me pueden escribir personalmente. Okay, very good. So, we are doing right now, we're going to look at section four, exercise one, vocabulary. We're going to talk about clothes. Clothes. All right. Let me put the audio. Let's listen to this video. 
class you'll learn clothes vocabulary, particularly clothes which you wear. For Hold on, I want to. Quiero ver si lo puedo hacer más grande. Aquí está. For work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are clothes for leisure. Let's practice by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Clothes for work. Shirt. Okay, let's repeat. Shirt. Tie. Belt. Tie. Jacket. Belt. Pants. Jackets. Suit. Pants. Coat. Shoes. Blouse. Scarf. Skirt. High heels. Raincoat. Dress. Clothes for leisure. Hat. Sweater. Jeans. Gloves. Boots. Cap. T-shirt. Shorts. Socks. Sneakers. Pajamas. Swimsuits. Now it's your turn to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. I would like for you to talk about the clothes that you wear for work and the clothes that you wear for leisure. If the Okay. Vamos a hacer una actividad. Now it's your turn to practice the Okay. We're going to do an activity. Okay? So uh, let me see. Quiero escribir aquí las preguntas que vamos a usar. Voy a usar otro notepad. Okay. The questions that we're going to use for this for this is what do you wear for work? Okay. What do you wear for work? The other question that we're going to ask is what do you wear for leisure? Leisure time. Let me see. Make sure that I have it correct. Let me see. Uh, le okay, I got it. Leisure. Okay. What do you wear for work? What do you wear for leisure? Okay. Leisure is como para estar en la casa. Yes, correct. When you're at, at the house. Okay. Yes, correct. When you're in the house. You know, or tal vez si vas al super. O si vas a, a, la, a, a la gasolinera ahí nomás. O si vas ahí nomás. What do you wear for work? What do you wear for leisure? So, how do you respond? Well, first, you have to look at the voc vocabulary here. Y lo vamos a repasar una vez más aquí junto antes de irnos a los grupos. So, you can say, for work, I wear a... I wear a jacket, and a tie, una corbata, una jacket. Sweet. Uh, suit, suit, okay? Suit. I wear a suit, okay? Suit. To work. Uh, suit. You can also say maybe you work in mechanic, maybe you're a mechanic, okay? So I wear la botas. Muy importante, ¿verdad? Para But. los que trabajan afuera. I wear boots. But. But. Y voy a terminar to work. Al trabajo. Um, maybe you are a... Uh, maybe you are a, a teacher, like me. I wear a dress pants and a polo shirt. Okay. What do you wear for leisure? To be in the house. I wear Shirt. shorts. Shirt. Okay. 
I wear um, tennis shoes. Tennis. Parece no. Yes, very good. Y ahí van, ¿verdad? Ahí van describiendo. Ok. Now, another question. Eh, otra pregunta que vamos a hacer. Eh, what are you wearing now? Describe what you're wearing now. So, ¿qué es lo que tienen ahorita? So, I have a green polo shirt. Y pueden describir lo que tienen ahorita puesto. Okay. I have a green polo shirt. All right. So, voy a poner este ejemplo en el, en el, en el chat. Okay. En el chat de Zoom y en el chat de WhatsApp. And we're going to go to groups. So, van a hacer esa pregunta. Question number one, what are you wear? Uh, what do you wear for work? Question number two, what do you wear for leisure? And question number three, what are you wearing now? Okay, very good. Let's go to groups. Lo mismo grupo, está bien? Para no hacer mucho cambio? Yeah. All right, let's go to the groups. Carla, ¿está ahí? ¿Escucha? Sí, sí aquí estoy. Sí, escucha. Eh, ahorita vamos para los grupos. Nos vamos a dividir y vamos a lo, para los grupos. Sí, y no, no me ha caído la, la invitación. Fíjese el cuadrito. Mm, ok, pero sí, ya la mandé. Eh, la voy ya. a mandar otra vez al grupo. Dígame si ahorita Va, mismo se la acuerdo. acaba de enviar. Ah, sí, ahorita sí. Gracias. Hola. Hello. No ha caído la imagen, la, las preguntas, si te las grupo. Ok, perdón. Este, ahorita mismo se la mando. Pero en el Zoom, el chat de Zoom, no te cae. Ahorita estoy revisando. ¿El chat de Zoom? No. No. Ok, no problem, no problem. Pues sí. Pues sí. ¿Qué? Okay. Eh, what do you wear for work, Carla? Esther. Eh, I, I wear a jacket. And pants, no, jacket, I wear a jacket and I wear a skirt and high heels. Higher heels. Yes. Okay, very good, Carla, repeat. High heels. High heels. Yes, very good. Okay. High very good. heels. Now, okay. what happens if I want to use color? Si quiero describir el color, uh, you can say, por, por, tal vez tengo un uniforme para el trabajo. I say, I wear a white shirt. I wear a blue skirt. Okay. Mm -hmm. Si quiero describir el color. All right. ¿Cómo sería si quiero describir el color? 
puede repetir. For example, I have, I wear a blue skirt. Ajá. ¿Se da cuenta de que el color va primero? Sí, en inglés, es en la característica. Exacto. En, en el español es al revés, pero en el inglés, uh -huh. we say the adjective first. I, ha, I wear a blue skirt. Okay. Hoy pregunto yo a, a... Y ahí, teacher, tengo una pregunta. Escucho que dice A y se puede decir one. Uh, no, A. El artículo A. a es singular. So, se entiende de que estás hablando de una. Uh, no estamos hablando de cantidades. No. Uh, for mm. example, I wear a blue skirt. Se ha entendido de que solamente es una, es singular. Okay. Mm -hmm. Pablo, what do you wear for work? Uh, I wear black boots, black boots to work. Um, what else, Pablo? Do you wear pants? Yes, to work. I wear two, two white pants okay. and white shirts. Very good, very good. Okay, now you can ask Esther. Carla, what do you wear? What do you wear for leisure? I wear, I wear uh, tennis shoes, I wear jeans. Ajá, cuando, no sé, pero... Vaya, um, entonces, I wear hard blues, and skin, and, and pants. Okay. Let me ask you, let me ask you a question. Uh, Veronica, what do you wear for work? Uh -huh. I wear high blues and ski mm -hmm. and pants, 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 eh, no sé si está bien con pantalón de vestir, pants. How do you say pantalón de vestir? Mujer. How do you say it in English? Ah, uh, um, no, no sé. Pants, que no es pants. 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 ¿Cómo? Pants. Sí, porque... Sí, eso tenía la duda, porque jeans... Jeans son de deportes. Ven, vea. Ok. Okay, come on. So, okay, what do you wear for work? What do you wear for work, Veronica? No, no sabe. What do you wear for work? <laughs> I wear, no. I wear, uh, blues, shirt, eh, dijo hands, pants, um, no sé. Okay, good, ver, good. Cha chaqueta, ¿cómo se dice? Cha pants, jacket. Pants. Jacket. No, ya está preguntando sobre. Pants. Pants. Tú estás preguntando, me preguntaste Pants. cómo se dice chaqueta, ¿verdad? Pants. Jacket. Ajá, sí. Jacket. 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 Yes. Jacket. Jacket. Vaya. Ok. Ok. Very good. Very good. Okay, uh, another question that was there in the list of questions. Había otra pregunta. What do you wear sí, for última. leisure? What, what, what do you wear for leisure? I wear, I wear uh, tennis, shoes tennis. Uh, I see what, jeans. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. Victor, okay. what do you wear for leisure? Mm -hmm. I wear tennis shoes, t-shirt, and shorts. Okay, very good. Marvin, what do you wear for leisure? 
uh, I usually wear a shirt and in shorts and in fleet flops. Oh, flip flops. Very good. Flip -flops. Okay. And the other question was there. Uh, what are you wearing now? Que tienen ahorita? Now I will, uh, I wear a shirt, a black what shirt. What color? What color? Black shirt. Okay. Black shirt and I... blue shorts and flip flops. Okay. Very good. Victor, what are you wearing now? I'm wearing casket and blue t-shirt and blue shorts. Good. Veronica, what are you wearing now? I have I have a, a base blues. Mm -hmm. Blues and a chair. Vestir, falda. Skirt. Skirt. Okay, skirt. Okay. Okay, very good. Very good. Ya vamos a regresar. Eh, Verónica, te recomiendo ver ese video y, y, y practicar la pronunciación del vocabulario. Okay? Okay. So, ese video es el 4.1. Tal vez no lo habían visto porque acabo de iniciar esta sección. Eh, play. Listen, repeat. Play, listen, repeat. And, Veronica, think in English. Think in English. Think in English. Think in English. No. Okay. Think in English. Think in English. Okay. Yes, very good. Okay. Bueno, voy a regresar. Sí, está bien. Vamos a regresar okay. en un minuto. Okay, okay, welcome back. Very good. What was the questions? Number one, what do you wear for work? What do you wear for work? Question number two, what do you wear for leisure? What do you wear for leisure? And question number three, what are you wearing now? What are you wearing now? Okay. Uh, so let me show you uh, a very quick presentation. I want you to see. Okay. Uh, this is uh, the vocabulary that we had for this section. Okay. Uh, Algunos le costó un poquito la pronunciación. Uh, you can listen to the video and you can repeat. Okay. Repeat. Um, no, lo voy a, no lo voy a cubrir ahorita. Lo pueden hacer ustedes individualmente para mejorar la pronunciación. Okay. Uh, I want you to see something in English. When we use the adjectives in English, we put the color first. Okay. For example, eh, in English, we say, I wear a blue jacket to work. Okay. 
en español se, eh, sería al revés. Yo uso una chaqueta azul para el trabajo. Sería al revés. ¿Ustedes ven cómo cambia la posición del color? Cuando lo digo en español y lo digo en inglés. No se, no, no se confundan porque eso es eh, algo muy que nos confunde al principio. En el, inglés, adjetivo. el adjetivo va primero. En inglés, the adjective Antes goes del noun. before the noun. So, we use adjectives to describe the nouns. A noun is a person, place, or a thing. The adjective goes before the noun. Okay? I wear a blue jacket to work. ¿Quién me puede dar un, unos ejemplos ahí de lo eh, que estaban hablando con sus compañeros? Contestando la primera pregunta, what do you wear to work? I wear, I wear uh, a sport shirt. Ok, very good Marvin. I wear a sport shirt. Eh, next, ¿alguien más? What do you wear to work? I wear a, a black jacket to work. Very good, very good, Joaquín. I wear a black jacket to work. En español sería al revés, ¿verdad? Yo yes. uso una chaqueta negra, el, el color va al final. In, in English, no, the color first. All right, so look at the people here. Look at the presentation. Look at the people wow. here. Let's go, number one. Eh, vamos, a, vamos a ir así de, de izquierda a derecha, desde arriba. What is this guy wearing? What is he wearing? wearing? He is wearing... He's wearing... Uh, He's wearing... Uh, white green shirt. jeans. Ok, vamos a ir a... Voy a nombrar a algunas personas, así eh, participamos okay. un poquito más organizado. Larisa, number one. Ok, he's wearing a uh, uh, green jeans. Yes. Jeans. Green jeans. Mm -hmm. um, um, t-shirt, uh, a blue t-shirt mm -hmm. and uh, uh, black. Uh, he's, uh, he's wearing a, a black, uh, a white. Um, uh, how do you say? Uh, uh, Long sleeve shirt. No, long long sleeve shirt. Long sleeve shirt. Shirt. Long sleeve shirt. No, listen. Escuche. Long sleeve shirt. Long sleeve sleeve sleeves. 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 Yes. Ah, sleeves. Okay, very good. Number two, Joaquin. Look at the guy. The next person. What is he wearing? He's, he's wearing blue jacket. Yes. And one more. He's, and white jean. Very good. Dos, dos eh, descripciones de cada foto. Okay, the next picture. Eh, I don't know if you can listen to me there. Veronica Lopez. Next picture. What do you see? He's wearing. I um, he's he wear pants. Pants. Aha, uh -huh. what color um, pants? Um, sweater. Okay. And if Black. I want to if I want to describe the color, quiero agregar el color, how do you say it? Mm -hmm. Black. Ajá. Black on, and white. Black and white shirt. Okay. Black white. Ok, descríbeme lo, los pantalones. Okay. Descríbeme los pantalones con el color, por favor. Es... ¿Qué voy a ver? Green. White. Green uh, pants. Yes, green pants. Okay. Yes, he's wearing green pants. Ahí está. El color primero y después el vocabulario que aprendimos. Ok, eh, let's see, another person that's there. Mauricio, number, picture number four. Uh, he is wearing t 
T-shirt brown. T-shirt brown or brown T-shirt? Uh, brown T-shirt. Yes. Brown T-shirt. Yeah. Uh, he's wearing pants, white pants. Pants white or white pants? Uh, wh white pants. Yes. Uh, he is wearing uh, tennis shoes. What color? Um, brown tennis shoes. Yes, very good, very good. Al principio cuesta poner el color primero, okay? But it, that's the way you speak English, okay? Let's see, number one, uh, the, the, next, the, the next line here. Uh, let's see, who else do we have? We have Marvin Castro, are you there? Yes? Uh, she wear a uh, white t-shirt. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, blue, blue jeans. Yes, very good. Very good, Marvin. Alejandra, are you there? Alejandra Vasquez, are you there? Yes. Okay, can you describe the next person? Uh, she is wearing uh, orange and uh, orange blues. <laughs> White. Fun. Sorry. Okay, very good. Teníamos ahí una interferencia. Okay. She's wearing orange blouse and white pants. Very good. Okay, next. Ivan, are you there? Ivan Flores, are you there? Yes, yes. Can you describe the next person? Yeah, she's wearing a blue dress. Yes. Yes, only. <laughs> okay, you see, so listen, right? Maybe I think her socks are brown. <laughs> brown. <laughs> brown socks. Okay, and the last person there, Pablo, I don't know if you're there. Can you hear me? Pablo? Yes, yes. Okay, good. I am Can here. you describe the next person? The last person there? What is she wearing? She's wearing a, a white shirt and she's wearing a green pant. Very good. Very good, Pablo. Okay, very good. Microfono abierto. Describe. What are they wearing? They yeah, wearing uniform. Mm -hmm. They wearing blue uniform. Very good. And and boots. And, boots. and Color, black colors. boots. Black yeah. boots. And black Very boots. good. Excellent. Excellent job. And glass okay. and and glass. Yes. Hey. And, in glasses. glasses. Very good, very good. Okay, so that, that that's what we're going to do. Ese prácticamente es la lección 4.1, okay? Color and adjectives and clothes, vocabulary, okay? ¿Cómo se dice corbata? Tie. 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 Very good. Ajá. ¿Cómo se dice falda? De De mujer? Dress. No. Dress. Ese vestido. Skirt. 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 Ok. Calcetines. Socks. Socks. Very good. Um, what do you wear when you go to the beach? ¿Qué usamos cuando vamos a la playa? What do you wear? Swimming. ¿Qué decía? ¿Se acuerdan? Swimming suit. Shorts. Uh -huh. Shorts. And swimming suit. Swimming suit, decía. Swimming Sandals. Suit. Sandals. Okay. Shirt. shirt. You can wear a shirt. Ok, very good. Para protegerme del, del sol, ¿qué uso? Cup. Sunglass. Sunglass. Ok, yeah. Puede ser sunglasses. Uh -huh. What else? In my head. Cup. What do I use? Cap. Cap. A cap. cap, you can say cap. Uh -huh. También puedes decir hat. 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 
Um, hat. Hat, tam hat también es sombrero en inglés, pero you, know, hat. you understand. Hat. Okay, very good. So I, I study the vocabulary, okay? That is video 4.1. Dele en play otra vez. Practice the pronunciation, okay? Practice the spelling, como se escribe, how do you pronounce it? And then you can, we'll continue tomorrow, okay? Very good. Okay. okay. Casi todos han terminado el examen, so lo felicito. Uh, if you have any questions, please tell me, okay? All right, okay. very good. I'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. tomorrow. Thank okay. you. Tomorrow. Bye bye. 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 bye.